I'm focused. Who else needs to die before you learn? They took your family. They took your world. How will you make them pay? What will you take from them? Mm. Ha! Oof! <laughs> there it is! I can get something out of you. Useless boy, silent for days, but hitting, hitting works! A sword is just a useless lump of rock until it is struck. You want to save the world? You want to get revenge? Then strike! <laughs> See? You weren't expecting a rock in there, were you? I wanted to change your face, so I struck it. What a lovely shade of red. Aw, oh, is baby sad? Does baby want his sister? Uh, well, your sister's dead. We can precious things die when they're not protected. Do you want to hear a joke? What happens when a band of goblins invades a village filled with unprepared, untrained, weak farmers with shoddy defenses, flammable housing, and a single uninspected cabinet? They leave behind a joke. Now let's make sure you have a strong punchline joke. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Goblin. No. No. Uh uh. Finally awake, I see. You had us scared for a bit, Goblin Slayer. Luckily, I was here for you. I was able to ask Iomade to use true resurrection to bring you back from the dead. All it took was a night of rest together. So, how was it? Sharing a bed with me. What about Priestess? Is she okay? Oh, her role was minimal. The ritual required a 25,000 gold piece diamond, which the church provided. My casting services, which are always free for you, and the presence of a virgin. Sadly, I was not able to fill the last requirement. It happened when I was quite young, not much older than her. I was alone. The goblins, you know what they're like. I cried out, asking for someone, anyone, to save me. But no one came. God, it's pathetic, isn't it? Someone like me, wielding the power of a god, limitless riches at my disposal, legions of adoring fans, and these terrors still haunt me. I still cry out at night, terrified to relive that day, still crying out for a hero. Goblin Slayer, if I called out to you, screaming in the night, would you come running? Um, I... Just think about it. It really helped to fall asleep by your side. Yeah, the ritual worked. Thank you. Are you sure you're okay? Any open wounds? Internal bleeding? Boo-boos of any size? It's fine. I'm fine. Uh, are you sure? You seem quieter than usual. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm the same old good old Goblin Slayer! And I slay goblins! <laughs> well, fifth door's the charm! Hey! I was right! There's Goblin Slayer! You two done sleeping together yet? I know about true resurrection, I know what goes down. I was determined to eat your meat as a show of respect to maintain lizard folk tradition, but I was drugged with sleepy cheese and chained to the floor. Thanks a lot. You would have made an excellent skeletal warrior, Goblin Slayer. Are you sure you don't want to reconsider death? Other goblins? I have no time to die. How's Goblin Slayer Jr.? My boy? My baby boy? My birdie baby boy? I fed him a shit ton of seeds and that bird's never been fatter. Also, GSJ laid an egg, so you're a grandpa now. Sweet. Speaking of good news, did you hear? The hero defeated the demon lord. He was like, no, please don't slay me. And the hero was like, oh no, and cut him up into a million billion pieces. <laughs> it seems this fulfills our obligations to our clans. Hooray, we're out of a job, homeless again. 
Mm. Oh, the parties they'll be having in the Five Kings Mountains will be wild enough to level the Emperor's Peak. I'm looking forward to getting blitzed as a hero. It'll be a nice change of pace from getting blitzed as, you know, some dude. I hope they'll have cheese! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're not invited. Uh, wait, what? <clears throat> I think you're all forgetting about something. There's still goblins in these sewers that need killing. And there's a goblin slayer in this room that needs to do that killing! Ah! About that... Uh... No time to waste! I already said... Ah! This is an intervention. Intervention? I don't need no negative levels! No, intervention. You literally died. It's time to stop. We know we can't stop you for long, so take a day. Rest up. I don't wanna! I don't wanna! I don't wanna! I don't wanna. There, there, Goblin Slayer. We don't have to slay goblins. We can do other things. Would fixing up your armor make you feel better? No! I don't know. Maybe. Okay, we'll go get your armor fixed up. <laughs> no, was that lip? No attitude, Mr. Man, or we're not going out for treats later. I like treats. Fine. You kidding me? This chain shirt has a hole in it. It's supposed to have lots of holes. It's... it's chain. Wow, I sure do love that kind of attitude in my store. You sure do know more than me. You want me to fix it or what? Though... Now that I think of it, maybe you're better off getting entirely new armor instead. Uh, you know, we do fittings free of charge. Wait, um, uh... Oh, you do fittings? Perfect! Wait, what the fuck? Why are you all dressing here? Saves time! Now get to it! I want you to memorize every inch of me. No, don't jump over the counter! What are you doing? You can't oh, measure oh, the God, shit out of me! I'll lay over there! Don't don't that, no, Give me my free fitting! No, oh my God, my eyes! Hey, kids! Who wants to taste some ice cream? Ah! Ice cream! Ice cream? Do they, like, scream at ice and eat it? If that's how they do it, you'd be a pro. Why would you say that? Come on, Goblin Slayer, let's go! What's gone into you? You're acting like a child. Like those goblin-sized adults over there! You mean the children? That's what I said. Well, I am only 15, so I'm gonna go get some. <laughs> 15? What the fuck? Give me one with two scoops and sprinkles and a cherry and a bowl. I'm gonna eat that bowl. Way past chill. Let me tell you guys the story of ice cream. No. There once was a scientist. I said no. And after that scientist was imprisoned for heresy, we used his heretical icebox to delight the children of the world. Would you like to hear a rap about the whole affair? Please, no. You'll Make me resort to violence! Yo! This is a story all about. Ah! <laughs> I had to kill that screamsman. Wouldn't stop rapping. It's disgusting. I, uh, I'm glad you're enjoying yourself, Goblin Slayer. You're branching out into new and exciting hobbies. Like killing annoying people? Eh, I don't think it's gonna stick. I got one love priestess. The goblins call to me. What about you? Oh, um, you know. Adventuring, questing, yada yada. Yada yada? You sure that's everything? I... I don't know. Well, okay. It's kind of pathetic, but I've been terrified of losing you. Ever since the first day we met, I've been afraid to go out adventuring without you. I don't know where I'd be if you weren't there to save me. What do you mean? I know where I'd be if it wasn't for you. Dead! Bled out in a cave in a sewer, killed by a 20-foot tall goblin. Lizzie Priest would have picked me dry, and I'd be carrying our gear as a skeleton page. But you, you're resourceful, determined. You'd be fine without me. No, I wouldn't. If you hadn't come along that day, I don't know what would have happened to me. Everyone has dark moments where they need help. I helped you once when you really needed it, but you're not helpless. What would make you say something like that? Well... The sword maiden and I were talking, and... Sword maiden? Who? Oh, wait, I remember. My braid is still wired after I died it. Once, when I was a child, my big sister told me that the ground was covered in invisible lava. I stayed up in the trees like a monkey for weeks on end. People in the village made fun of me, called me the monkey kid. Oh, look at the freaky monkey kid! I fling rocks at them in streets like a capuchin! But at the end of the day, the joke was on them. A nearby volcano erupted and flooded the village. It'd be real poetic if they hadn't been killed two weeks earlier by a band of filthy goblins. Oh, oh God, the memories. 
I just wanted to come for you priestess, but the memories, they're coming back! Everything I love, die! <laughs> uh, except for... Anyways, I'd appreciate if you keep these details private. I haven't shared them with anyone else before. How's that ice cream, by the way? Holy wow, are you okay? What is it, Lava? I trained my whole life for this moment! Stacy. <laughs> did, did you just eat the cardboard bowl? <coughs> That's a lot, Goblin Slayer. Do you want to go somewhere and talk about it, or...? You're not going anywhere. Not till I give you a piece of my mind. You have any idea how long of a carriage ride it is to get here? Just to deliver some flour? The witch could have cast teleport. That's how we used to get around. Could you have? Sure. But you're not worth the spell slot. Rude. I'm still charging you for a silver rank quest. You got any trolls or dire barracudas you want me to slay while I'm here? Nope. Just need me that sweet, sweet flower. <laughs> Love me some flower. All right, whack job. It's your money. I am curious, though. Could you not buy flower? Here? How much more got paid to mind your own business? That'll be a second silver-ranked fee, thank you very much. Done! Now get out of my water town! Back at it again in the sewers, killing some goblins! Well, it seems like you're back to tip-top shape, Goblin Slayer. Yeah, you're armed to the teeth with a new sword, daggers, and a, a bag of flour. Why are you carrying that? Are you gonna make a cake for the goblins? Don't address it, he's been trying to keep it a secret. Yeah! Get your grubby elf ears off my bee's knees! As far as you're concerned, my sack doesn't exist! Lizard Priest, are we almost there? Oi! What the what is that? A floating eye! I mentioned it earlier. I was like, Oi! You're welcome. Wait! Could this be a beholder? Ah, uh, shit! Looks like we might be able to slay some big, bad, evil thing after all! I don't know. Does it kinda not look all there to you? Note the central eye. The pupil moves over the veins on the side. The eye doesn't rotate within a socket, but rather the pupil itself can move freely of the organ. Oh, is that a clue to how we can beat it? No, it's just gross and weird. Ugh, I hate it. Nasty. Perhaps the beast is friendly. Take this rock as an offering of friendship. None can possibly resist the siren song of rock. We've got this in the bag. Centuries of dwarven heritage spat upon! Do we even have to be here? It's not even our job to kill this guy. You know what? You're right, priestess. I guess we can just go around. Oh no, we're taking this thing out. Killing a beholder comes with huge bragging rights. The hero killed the demon lord, but we can kill this guy. <laughs> Look, I know it's not the same, but please just let me have this. Fine. If you waste to use this on anything but a goblin, but I guess it's time to bake us a cake. I'm just gonna pretend that what you said made sense and start shooting at it. Your disintegration rays are gonna need to be a lot faster than that if you want to turn me to dust! There there, big guy. Time for you to enter the deep slumber! Isn't this thing supposed to be able to cancel magic? I, I shouldn't be able to do that. Cake time. <coughs> what are you doing? Stop kicking up dust and help! I get it. You're using the flower as a smoke screen to blind it. Both wrong! Yeah, run! Run for your lives! Run in, of course! Go, we're bone uncle! Elf, hit one of its eyes! Priestess, cast protection! Make sure you don't mess up! Or we're all experiencing the worst pain imaginable! Okay, here I go! Earth Mother, it's me! Yep, 
feisty girl. You know I need some protection right about now, so... Remember when these incantations used to sound like poems? Got them slayed from the past, remembers. There's no ah! Protection! Here comes the boom. So, should I retrieve my skeletal uncle, or...? <laughs> There was no way we could have anticipated that that was your plan. Oh, my skunkle melted to the stone floor. You guys got a spare skunkle? Goblin Slayer, would you like to die again? I could use them bones! Are we even sure that was a beholder? Because killing a beholder is supposed to be cool. Like, a whole adventure kind of cool. Oh, this is supposed to be a challenge? That, that was supposed to be hard? <sighs> Whatever. That was a gazer at best. Unless it's a beholder that came from a bullshit dimension where everything sucks. Now, big floating goblin, that would be a challenge. It didn't even use all 10 of its eye beams. There were still nine more. <gasps> maybe it's got good treasure. Was it protecting something cool? A mirror. But maybe behind the mirror, there's some artifacts or... Just give up. There's nothing cool here. I don't know. This mirror seems pretty neat to me. You're cool, right, Mr. Mirror? Ew, gross. What was that? Ah! that? That's gate! Again! I even the mirror has gate? A permanent gate? Does everyone here know gate but me? This mirror, its make is either ancient or elven. It's probably the only one of its kind in the world. Sick! Cool mirror! We gotta destroy it! Come on, man! Don't use that tone with me, elf! This mirror's been compromised! Goblinated! They use it to teleport around! Like I told you earlier, the only thing worse than a goblin is a teleporting goblin! Hey guys, speaking of goblins, I think I hear goblins. Perhaps they will be friendly. Oh wait, no. Yeah, they're goblins, I forgot. They must meet a chiseless fate. That's death in case I wasn't clear. So this time we're gonna fight them together, right? Of course! I studied all their tactics in the last encounter. I know the only way we get through this is by working together as a team. Wow, Goblin Slayer. Looks like you really grew as a person. And when we kill all the goblins together, we can spit on their corpses and laugh at them together. Like real Goblin Slayer Batman! Together, yeah. <laughs> Okay, Elf. This plan's a little more complicated than normal, so make sure to pay attention. Hit him. We hit him. Till they die. Got all that? Yeah, I think I get the gist. Okay, now do that till they all die. chance. And if you're not, you will be. As much as I'm itchy for a rematch, Tiny, I'd rather make sure to put you down for good. So, Lizard Priest, go! Right! I call upon the strength of those who came before me, whose flesh bolsters my own. Let me your mighty strength! Uh, okay, uh, even with the strength of my ancestors, this is still really heavy. I can help! Oh, oh, thank you so much. This is totally helping. Uh, does anyone else want to help? J just me? Okay. Now it's my turn to do my thing! The kill! <laughs> Whoa! 
And I couldn't have done it without you. Second cousin Jim Bob, who I summoned earlier when nobody was watching. Woo! Is there reason any more help down here? Woo! Yeah! Go see, go see, Batman! Now, face the mirror upwards! <laughs> Goblin Slayer, does that mean you'll tell me your fucking plan before we do it for once? We point the mirror towards the sky to get our freedom! No, I, I guess you won't. You're just fucking crazy. Thank Torag, I'm just drunk enough to deal with this bullshit. Just shoot them rocks up in the air! Do it! Teamwork! Whatever! I'll wait for the signal, I guess. Goblin Slayer, we gotta go now! Okay, what's that? Okay, I'm good! Priestess, do your thing! Oh, I'm guessing that's the signal, because no one told me anything! Stone Cold! another rock ever again. I'll assume you're delirious from combat. Or maybe you just have no taste. <clears throat> Thank the cheese god that is mirror to call the rubble. Wouldn't want to be the person on the other side. The goblins in the mirror? Yeah, they probably did. Goblin Slayer, what you did there was the coolest thing ever! And it was all thanks to my teamwork. You mean our teamwork. Yes, my teamwork. Yours got me killed! Remember that? Oh, shut up. Ah, 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 oh, ah! oh no, my ass! All the potions in my ass exploded! My anus is bleeding! Ah! You broke my ass! Um, I'm out of spells? I can't heal that. Oh, he'll be fine. Uh, uh, ah! <laughs> Well, thanks for bringing me back from the dead a second time. Not a problem. Though we are beginning to run out of priceless gems, Goblin Slayer. The only one we have left is you. That was a sword maiden joke. I know you're not a diamond. Cool. I'll work on dying less, I guess. So, have you finished your business in the sewers, or will you be returning? There better be another one of your sword maiden jokes. Whatever do you mean? I've known something was fishy the moment I stepped into town. And it wasn't the fish, or the ice screamsmen. It was the goblins. Exactly. That's why I called you. Hold up there, sword, missy. Ma'am? Sword, ma'am? Sir? Goblins don't assassinate women indiscriminately. Their prey wouldn't be so lucky as to bleed out in the sewers. When you told me your act like girls' bodies were found outside a goblin's den, I had my suspicions. But it only got worse from there. Goblins with ships. Goblins with magical mirrors! Goblins with pirate accents! This colony was trained by other, more intelligent humanoids. But someone got rid of those humanoids, and too well. Cleaned up their tracks. But who would be powerful and knowledgeable enough to take out a small army without anyone ever knowing? Huh? Huh? You know, I probably should have realized the world's foremost goblin expert would have noticed something like that. I usually don't take things, but thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. I may have, uh, fibbed about how big a threat the goblins were. There was a cult, one that worshipped the demon lord. They used the mirror and trained the goblins to be their muscle, sacrificing the girls for the glory of the demon lord. The thing is, I may have also... Use a trained giant crocodile systematically destroy the cult down to its foundations and hit the evidence where I can notice? Well, I did notice! Oh, Linda? She's not trained. Who's Linda? What the fuck? The dire crocodile? She's my familiar? I can see through her eyes and control her body whenever I want. I feel all the same stuff she feels. It's why I take so many baths. Because, you know, sewers are gross. Yeah. Oh! Okay, that's... that's something else. How come Priestess knows your favorite bird, but doesn't know you pilot a crocodile? One never can be too careful with information like that. 
The cult certainly didn't see it coming. So, did you, like, eat him? As the crocodile? Wait! Did you charge at us in the sewers? Why did you attack the goblins on the ship if you want us to kill them? WHY ARE YOU LIKE THIS?! Okay, in order. One, no, I don't eat people. Two, I got excited when I saw you and decided it was a good time for a sword maiden prank. And, uh... Go on! Three, I passed out when I saw the goblins and... Linda took over. <laughs> goblins?! What?! Okay, I can do this! I got this! Oh, I can't do this! I don't got this! I, I don't got- I don't got this! I told you before, about that time long ago, with the goblins. I've been terrified of them ever since. Even with all this power and fame and money, I can't get the one thing I truly want. Peace. I want to go to sleep once, and not relive that day. I just want to feel safe. And... I think... You... I think you could make me feel safe, Goblin Slayer. Hmm... Pathetic. A waste of my time. You could turn into a cult slaying kaiju monstrosity! And you ask for my help? I do my job for the love of killing goblins, sure. But that's not the only reason. I do it because somewhere out there, a nameless village no one will remember, might get burnt to the ground if someone doesn't step in and kill some filthy goblins before they attack. So that a family with a name no one will remember gets to see another day with their loved ones. You have unlimited resources. You could have asked anyone in the world for help. You have the God of Justice on speed dial. And you're trying to guilt trip me to live with you? If I'm not out there killing goblins, some innocent girl might suffer the same fate as you. Or worse, people might die because you're lured as your sword maiden. For your own selfish reasons. I can't believe Priestess looks up to you. Goblin Slayer, wait! I'm sorry! Please! Tell you what, when there are no more goblins left to kill, I'll kill the ones in your dreams. Till then, be someone the priestess can look up to. She can become so much more than this. <laughs> yeah, I see why you look up the sword maiden, priestess. She said she's gonna invent a spell that teleports me to her dreams to kill dream goblins. Apparently there's a lot of goblins in there? I don't know. That doesn't sound like a thing. That's probably not real, Goblin Slayer. Nope, that's a thing. Dream travel. Six level spell. Look it up. I am quite excited to return to Droon, my homeland. Much of my family passed away in a plague I narrowly avoided in coming here. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Lizard Priest. Are you okay? Yeah, this is cause for much celebration. I can collect their bones and summon them for future adventures. I must make haste, though, if I wish to eat their meat. Oh, you're happy for necromancy reasons. That's still super evil. I'm opting out of this conversation. Oh, I can't wait to get home either. The dwarves make the only kind of beer that can actually get me drunk. Plus, it doubles as an explosive agent. So that's cool too. Anyway, what about the rest of you? I think I might stick around town for a bit before heading home. I know the demon lord is dead, but that means his minions are prime quest material. I'm gonna get some of that action. When I have downtime in between killing goblins, I'm gonna volunteer at the guild. I wanna get close to guild girl and learn her sass secrets. I'm really shy now, but in time, I'm gonna burn someone so bad that another person in the background will say, oh no, she didn't. That's the dream. Okay, cool, so we all got stuff going on. Oh, um, Goblin Slayer, if you ever want to talk about what you told me earlier, I- Oh, did you hear? The hero killed the Demon Lord! Yeah, yeah, we know. Thanks. Oh, it's just really big news to me is all. <laughs> Fuck me for trying to be part of the conversation though, am I right? God, I'm losing a star for this shit. Yeah, yeah you are. Fuck. It really didn't say what you had going on, Goblin Slayer. Probably just slaying more goblins though, right? Why, well, there's goblins. I got no time to die. Oops, I died twice. Geez, are you like that all the time, even when we're not around? I'm sure Goblin Slayer is a deep, multifaceted individual like myself. 
Anyway, who's got more cheese? <laughs> well, if there's no more Galvasine quests, then... I guess I'll just go home. Hey folks, get old Goblin Slayer here! Everyone's favorite slayer of goblins! Probably wondering what we did with that mirror. We threw it away! It's at the bottom of the sewers, sucking up poop like nobody's business! Anyways, follow the Shmuck Squad on Twitch and Twitter! Also, go to their Patreon if you want. Water Town's probably run out of water since the mirror's shooting into the goblin's home now. Everybody wins! Okay, bye!